In this situation, you have air getting into the circuit without a saline reservoir hanging. Your first two steps will be the same steps. The order depends on which is quickest. Grab clamps and then first clamp the return line and then clamp on the patient side of the manifold on the negative side. Now you have the air isolated to one area of the pump. Go down to zero RPMs and clamping the circuit will always be your first two steps. When blood and air mix, it will turn into foam. Foam in the circuit is bad. Remove the yellow cap. To replace air, you need some source of volume. In this instance, we do not have fluid readily available, so unclamp the negative side. Use 50 mil lure lock syringe on the pigtail to pull back and remove air. Remember, air rises. Once you fill the syringe, quickly squirt the blood and air on the ground and then remove more air if needed. When you are only getting blood, you should be in the clear. You can also pull from the manifold and get air out from the positive side of the manifold. If the manifold has air on the negative side, you can pull back and reprime. After air is removed, go back up to 1500 RPMs and unclamp. Then gradually return to previous flows. If there are small air bubbles, allow them to vent out until you no longer hear the sound of air. Lastly, put yellow cap back on. 